So, this is actually a terrible idea. It is currently 1219 in the morning. So I don't know why, but I've just decided to buy a Japanese horror game. And if there's anything about Japanese horror games is that they are the absolute worst. And I mean that in a good way. They are the best at being the worst. Meaning they're honestly, in my opinion, they are the scariest of horror games. Now, this is a very short indie horror game. It's about 40, 50 minutes at most, give or take. And I don't know much about it, but I've been watching it for the last few days and I've been really, really intrigued. And I know that if I don't buy it now and play it now, I, it would just sit on my Steam account and I will never play it. It's essentially you're delivering packages around the building and just, you know, scary shit happens. But what else do you expect? I typically don't do like indie games at all, horror games. I do some of them, but not a whole lot of indie games in general. I know they're funky, but I know that there is an audience out there for them. So if you guys would like to see more of this, just drop the video a like and uh, maybe maybe we'll get into some of these in the near future. But anyways, thank you for being here with me. It's going to be interesting. And by the way, I've, I've got this. Don't don't even judge right now, but I've got this. Somebody sent me this today, which is really fucking scary. Somebody sent me. It's actually a game. A company sent me this. Um, I forgot the name of the game right now, but yeah, it's it's yeah. Delivery man. Use the mouse WASD for movements. Press left mouse to interact. Oh dear. Oh God. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, what the fuck? Okay, hold on. So we've got this whole VHS tape thing going on as well. Like, it's so dark here. Um, I'm assuming these are the packages I gotta deliver. This is my last stop. Of course it's your last stop. It's the stop you're probably going to die, bro. After I deliver these five packages, I'm done for today. I feel bad for you guys that work for UPS and, and stuff like that. You have a great career, but playing this game or watching this, just, just leave. Trust me, you're going to have nightmares. Package E. Deliver this package. Um. Yes. Okay. Press tab to open up your inventory. You can also switch items using your mouse scroll. Room 206. Wait, so you're telling me that I can't go in the back of the truck and get all the other packages? I gotta... Okay, so room 206. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna head over... What the heck was that? Look at this building, bro. I'm sorry, but if it's this late at night, don't be delivering packages. Oh, there's a cat right there. A little kitty cat. Uh, I don't. No. Oh, you're one rude ass little kitty cat, little pussy cat. All right, room tool six. Here we go. Let me just make sure there's nothing down here. Dude, the, the, the actual look of this game is terrifying. This game doesn't even... I don't think this game even has to do anything. It's just... Just roaming around is already giving me the creeps. Okay. We're gonna head upstairs, okay? This reminds me, I saw a video a couple of weeks ago on YouTube of a guy with a GoPro walking around Japan during the rain in 4K. And it was actually super cool. I've never been to Japan, but I, I don't know. Just seeing foreign country like that in you know first person perspective it just felt like you were there I, I felt like I was there with the guy and it was really cool and I know it has nothing to do with this since we are playing a Japanese horror game I thought I'd tell you guys alright so we're going to okay doorbell intercom or knock on the door Hello? Oh. Oh, so I can deliver the package through there, but it's shut tight. Okay. Ma'am, sir, I've got your package. It's kind of late. I'm hungry. 
and I need to take a massive dump. So will you please take package? I gotta go. I gotta go. Okay, so what happens if they don't open up the door? Um. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Dude. Oh, uh, you took way too long. Get the hell out of my face. Hey, that is rude, mister. <laughs> what the hell did I? What the fuck? Oh my. All right. You know what? Next time. Screw your package. I'm leaving it with the cat downstairs. That's what I'm going to do. Room 206. I'll remember you. Don't you worry about that. Got this. All right, guys. Um, Anything scary down there? Nair? I'm going to call it right now. Something is going to happen with that cat. That cat is going to do... Oh, fuck. Fuck. All right. Okay. Now, I want to know who the hell opened up my truck because I didn't open it. I wasn't even here. Huh? Alright, let's go to package B. Yes, let's deliver package B. This is interesting. It's kinda like kinda like a uh get a package delivered. It's, it's a turn base type of game. That makes no sense. I'm sorry. I'm talking nonsense. What five oh two boys, we're going to the fifth flow. Brother man from the fifth flow. Okay. Here we go. You know what's crazy? This game is not that like impressive graphically wise but it's running at like 50 frames oh okay how do you expect me to go to the fifth floor okay there has to be some sort of elevator correct hmm is there an elevator here so it's 502 all right there is no elevator okay so how do i deliver this package so I see it's not just go up the stairs. There's a little puzzle in the way now. We have to figure this out. Is that the elevator? Ooh. This is a very tight elevator. Holy crap. Hey, everything is totally fine. Nothing is going to happen. The doors are going to open. We're totally not going to get stuck in here. Yes, that's it. That's right. All right, we've arrived at the fifth floor. Package 502 right here. That's also sealed. I'm going to... Doorbell intercom. Hello? Thanks. I have a reward for your great service. You love cats too, don't you? Take it and be gone. Oh, hello, the little kitty cat. I will have a friend downstairs. I don't know how this is a reward for me, but <laughs> thanks, I guess. I'm going to call the elevator. All right, so we finally have some cat food, which I didn't, I didn't think we were going to get some cat food here. But you know what? We got the cat food. We're gone. Let's go. Here we go. Down to the first floor. I kind of wish that we can hold all the packages together. Don't have to keep going back. But I guess that's just the point of the game. Keep going back and things will keep happening. That, 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 that's just my perspective. My, my, my hypothesis as a gamer. Okay. There's the kitty cat. I actually really dig the whole 90s film thing going on. Oh, you see? Okay, so this is going to be probably a little rough, if, you know, with Japanese names and stuff like that. So, go, oh, hey. How are you doing? How's the new apartment? In the previous apartment, you had uh, to move because the residents there weren't so kind to you. Is it okay this time? Before, there were people who made a fool of themselves about disabilities and welfare, right? I said it many times before, but you weren't the bad one. Don't blame yourself also. Don't be impatient about getting a job. Oh, hey, you're my son. You'll be okay. Things get better soon. Well, that's a nice mommy.
Uh, what the fuck? Sir? Can, can I help you? All right. Um, sure, dude. Listen. L listen, you can... Yeah, all right. I was just giving the cat some food, all right? No need to get crazy with me. Just relax. Let me see if there's anything back here. I have a feeling... I have a feeling there's a crazy jump scare waiting to happen. Now, this is a game that I can already see. It's probably one of those games that doesn't really have insane amount of jump scares. It, it, it's just subtly horrifying. But let's just pretend like we're going to have some jump scares. We could never say never, okay? Because honestly, you just never know. All right, so I'm going to take a look at the cat. The cat's still there. The guy's still upstairs. What the fuck is that guy doing there? The cat is not here anymore. Okay, where's this pack? 401. Sir? Going to the fourth floor, you understand? If anything happens to me, you better call the police. My name, my name is Kenny. And I am delivering a package to the apartment 401. Okay, just thought I'd let you know. Perfect. I'm going to call the elevator. I don't trust that guy, by the way. I think he's good. He's up to something. I don't, I don't trust him. All right, come on, giddy up. Oh, oh, shit. All right. So maybe I got to go to the fifth floor. Excellent. I got to go to the fifth floor, go down, and let me see something. Let me go to... Hold on, make sure there's nothing here. Okay. I don't know why, but... Um, the graphics here are actually shadow quality don't sync depth of field hard and soft on shadows hs filter that's fine whatever all right so we're back on the fifth floor we're gonna go downstairs excellent 401 should be the first one right here correct yes this is the big package, okay? Big, big package. Here we go. Dude, you scared the shit out of me. What's wrong with you? I'm scared. Am I the only one? Aren't you scared? Yes, I'm fucking scared. This whole place, it's like I'm b becoming part of them. Never mind. Forget about it. All right, here, have your shitty package. Oh, m me? I I haven't left the room in... I, d I don't know. I, I stopped counting. Oh, right. You're here for a package. Don't know if I can tr trust you and your parcel just yet. Talk to the priest. I cannot trust you until you talk to the priest. He said he lives in apartment 105. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, fuck. Now we got to go back downstairs and talk to the priest. Oh, that is just wonderful. Wonderful. And let me, let me, let me ask. Okay, here little crawly things. I'm just going to say this right off the bat. The priest is probably not even going to be there. We're going to have to go inside his apartment and some crazy shit's going to go down. Why? Because that's the way these games like to roll. You know, I, I don't like rolling like this, but hey. You know, I got the, uh. SOS button in there that does absolutely nothing. Come on, open up. Oh, okay. Oh, damn. I should have gone to the first floor. Oh, 105, you said, right? 105. Got it. Should be all the way in the corner. 105. Here we go. Oh, fuck. Huh? Um, I see uh, Mikiru sent you here. Sorry, mispronunciation of anything. I'm the local priest. Say no more, fam. I can sense that the package is cursed. What? 
but I need to make an offering first before I can perform any <laughs> sanctification on the project. Monetary, that is. What the fuck? I need cash before I can perform any... What the fuck do you want? I don't have cash. Oh. Uh. Excuse me? Somebody just threw a water bottle. Oh, hi. Okay. A bottle of water. Okay, make sure there's nothing here. Got another one of these. There's probably cash in one of these bicycles. Look. Ooh. I wonder if these taste any good. All right, so I'm just going to check all the bikes. One of those got to have something, right? Fuck, dude. This game is terrifying. Hey, dude. You spoke to the priest? Yes, I did. D directly? How lucky you are. Um, I've only exchanged words through the, the door to intercom. Alrighty then. So he needs money. Why, of course. What the priest says is always right. Here, give this to him. Make sure to give it to him ASAP. I don't want the priest to be waiting any longer. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, sure. Um. Oh, God. See, now it's when, when, when the fear is starting to creep in. I don't know why, but I'm just suddenly scared. I am scared of the priest. Oh God, I'm fucking terrified. I'm gonna call it right now. The priest is not gonna be there. The priest is not gonna be there and we're gonna have to go inside his house. I'm calling it right now. I'm calling it, I'm calling it. I probably should have left this fucking big package for last. I knew it. Why go for the big package? Leave the big package for the end. But no, no, no. Okay, here you go. Let me double check the amount, bro. Jesus Christ. What? This cannot possibly be enough. Just Mikiru, Mikiru, Michiru, whatever. Really think that he can get away with this? Bro, what are you? Seriously, dude? What do it look like? A fucking errand boy here? I mean, technically, that is my, my duty right now, but... I work for the government, asshole. I don't work for you. And you know what? I'm going to be respectful towards the priest. He might be kind of crazy. But he does look a little bit upset. He doesn't sound upset, but he looks a little upset. Based on his demeanor that doesn't really change at all. He always has that stupid smile on. Just starting to freak me out. Alright, listen here, dude. Listen, the priest says you're a joke. And... Yeah, he wants more money, dude. That, yeah, that was not enough. Forgive the priest. I sure he forgives you. Um, I hope this much uh, will help. It's all I've got for this month. I have to ask my parents to give me more. Bro, this priest is a bully, bro. <laughs> this guy's a thief. Okay. Always are good. Perfect. So what I'm wondering is, why does the elevator go back down? I mean, I was just here. Let's go, giddy up. Now, mind you, this is building it up. It's building it up. I'm telling you right now, this is being built up and then it's going to hit you hard with it. I sense it. I feel it. I just, I have this vibe about this game right now. Okay, Mr. Priest, I've got your, uh, got your money. Uh, let's be civil about this. Okay, don't act any, don't do anything crazy. Wait. Oh, that's enough. Barely, that is. I'll forgive him this time. Jesus Christ, let us begin the ritual. What the fuck? Um. Done. Phew. Now go away. That's it? Uh... 
Well, I'm no longer carrying a cursed package, right? Well, that was fucking weird. Oh, God. I'm hearing things. Hurry up, hurry up. Back to the fifth floor. Whew. What is that noise, dude? Shit. Fifth floor, fifth floor. There we go. Excellent. All right, bro. I got your package. Forgive me, priest. I'm ready to take the package now. Go away. What the fuck? Th You're welcome. Bro, what is up with this place? Okay, I'm gonna go back downstairs. I guess I guess the big package wasn't the big deal. Now you better believe it's gonna be the last package of anything, right? We've got two more to go, I think. Actually, maybe three more to go. Okay, let's go. I'm 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 almost dying to get out of this shit. Gotta finish this. Come on. Come on. Open up, you stinking elevator. Let's go. It's like the game is programming me to do the same thing over and over again. Get to the elevator, go up the stairs, go down, go here, go to the elevator, go down, go here. And then it's going to hit me. It's going to whack me hard. I know it. I know it. It's coming. Be prepared. Be prepared. Be prepared. Okay. We got two more packages, actually. So I will go with package C. Sure. Now, package C, you see. Three oh five. Okay. A three oh five. All right. Nobody lingering around the hallways. Nothing crazy happening. 305, we're gonna go to 305 and we're probably just gonna go directly through the stairs. It's floor number two. 305. All right, let's see what the story is now at 305, huh? <clears throat> there we go. Knock on the door. That's right, open up. It's your uh, local delivery service. Oh my god. Oh fuck this. Hello? Oh, did you just close? Oh god, I'm fucking locked in here. Oh. Oh. I'll be right there. Ma'am, I can't even move. Oh, what the fuck? You take your shit. What the, what is wrong with this? <laughs> what are you doing? That package. It's a bed frame. You're going to help me build it, right? Uh, sure. Yes, yes. What, what, how do I? You want some water? No? Yeah, I will help you build it. Well, the game's not... There we go. Oh, hi. Um. That is so fucking creepy. Well, no, don't mind if I just... Uh, where, where's your Where's your bedroom? And where's your restroom? I need to take a dump. Oh, hi. Well, there we go. Hello. That's a nice sink. You does that really how the sink looks? Oh, that's just the graphics. Okay. So wait, what? What? What the hell? No sink. The sink's on top of the toilet. <laughs> Ma'am, I think you have a minor, uh, a minor, um, a diff, uh, not difficulty. Um, you know what? Never mind. I can't even talk right now. Um, I'm half not here, half asleep, half awake, and three fourth, uh, scared to death. 
Okay, so... Okay, I see the arrows. I just want to make sure that that, that that doesn't mean it. Some sort of crazy ritual or some shit. Okay, put the package here. Okay, set up the bed frame. Perfect. Look, I, I am, I've got to be the nicest delivery man ever. Okay, ma'am, your bed frame is built. Um, It looks wonderful, beautiful. I love the area, love the space. Um, oh. Ah, oh, what the fuck? Okay, who got murdered here? Okay, um. I want to get out of here. I want to go home. Ma'am? Holy crap. Holy crap. Okay. Okay, I'm out. We're going downstairs. We're gonna use the ladder. I mean, the, the ladder. I'm sorry, not the ladder, the stairs. See, this game is not like those games where it's like super... All right, what the fuck? That was not there before. Who is playing mind games? As I was saying, this is not one of those... Not one of those... One of those games where there's jump scares everywhere. But rather, it's it's just the mood. The vibe is very creepy. We're going to deliver the last and final package, of course. Duh. And this is going to go to room... 202. Room 202. That's gonna be up there. Isn't that the guy that threw the water bottle at me? Oh, that was the first guy, right? 202. Can I put it here? Alright, let me see if I can put the package here. No. Of course I can. All right, boss man, listen up. 202, knock on the door. Open up, bucko. Let's go. Let's get you up. Gotta go home. What is happening? Oh, what the fuck? No, no. My baby. You have to help me catch him. Uh, where the fuck did your baby go? Where'd he go? Damn, I've, I've got no idea where that kid went. Are you kidding me? There's a fucking baby on the loose. Guess when you thought I was ready to go home, this lady has a baby with no leash. Unacceptable. I'm just, I'm just kidding. Do not put your babies on. Don't put your babies on leashes, okay? That is not, that's not correct. And, and what, what really bothers me here is that it is so dark. Oh, wow. I didn't even know that I could go through here. Okay. Oh, there's a playground. Maybe he's here. Oh, that's a dog. Oh, hey. Hello there, doggy. Oh, hi. Oh, it was water. Oh. Okay, go ahead. You have uh, got to get used to the new environment. You said you're doing your best to get along with everyone in the apartment. Did you get uh, along well? I know that you're very kind. I hope that uh, the other people can feel that too. Start with one person first. Also, it's okay to work slowly. You tend to think pessimistically. Try to think positively. By the way, how's the dog? Akichi, was it? Give me the dog next time, okay, ma. Okay, so. Bro, if the baby is anywhere, it's gotta be here. Ooh, another one of those little sodas. All right, so, oh. Oh, what? 
Okay. So notice how we no longer have a package to, 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 to deliver. Now we just gotta go, just gotta find the baby. I think it was right in front of me, but it's so dark, I'm, I'm, I'm not too sure. Gotta hide in bushes? Now where's this stupid... Oh! <gasps> uh... What? Okay, hold on. I think they ran this way. This game is so weird, dude. Hello? Sir? Hello? Listen, it's one o'clock in the morning. I gotta go to sleep. Will you just pop up already? Fuck. Okay, so what if we go... Oh. I want to say the baby's all the way upstairs. Um, I'm just gonna... I'm, I'm just gonna check this side again. The bike is no longer here. Well, that's fucking interesting. What in the world? So, truth be told, I have to fart really badly, so... I'm just hoping this baby appears sooner than later. What if the baby went to the apartment where the cursed package was? Well, it wasn't really cursed anymore because we cleansed it with the priest, right? Nope. Nothing here. Well, now that we're on the fifth floor, let me just... Just go ahead and check this out. Nothing there. Nothing there. Oh, what the? Okay, there's nobody okay nobody's gonna open up that door so we're gonna go let's go to the fourth floor it's gotta be the fourth floor i don't know if that door opening like that that dude creeping up if it has anything to do with the baby but we're gonna go to the last and final floor and after this floor if i don't find anything i really don't know what it could be i'm gonna, ch I'm gonna check this one nothing there 402 is empty oh <gasps> Oh, no. No. I'm sorry. Oh, God. Oh, God. I don't like that sound. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. <sighs> Hello? Hi there, uh, little baby. Fuck. Show yourself, Satan. Okay, nice little shortcut. I got the fuck out of here. No, I am not allowed to leave. All right, listen, bro. This is just a video game. This is... Oh, that was probably not a good idea. Oh God. Oh God. Hello? Oh God. Oh my God, what the? F
There's the baby. Listen, when I speak to your mother, I'm gonna tell I'm gonna tell her to, to, to abandon you. You are cursed, child. Oh fuck! Yeah, they're not gonna let me leave, are they? Do I throw them down the balcony? Fuck them kids, just like Jordan said. No. I don't know why I do this. I'm just, I'm just. No. Are you thirsty for blood? <laughs> thirsty for blood, child. <laughs> what is that? A fridge? What is that? Are we supposed to make some sort of sacrifice with the child? Oh God, I'm so lost. No. All right, let's get out of here. Oh dear God. Hey, what? You? Huh? Oh, that's right, I gotta go to the fifth floor. I thought I was on the fifth floor for some reason. Okay, let me check that last door that was slightly opened last time. Just make sure now that I have the baby, they don't really... Yeah, I got a baby. <laughs> no? Okay. Oh, we're gonna head down. Dude, that was so freaky going in there. Oh, this is so different than anything I've played here on the channel. Usually everything i played is like, you know, like super jump scares and stuff like that this is more of a just uncomfortable type of feeling like you're playing it you're in a constant like mood of slight discomfort i don't know it's, it's hard to explain was it three was it 202 302 oh come on come on come on oh Oh, what the fuck? Where's, where, where's the baby? Hold on, I gotta go tell that. What has just happened? What has just happened? Three oh five package. Oh, my God. Two. Oh my god. Okay, so I gotta climb down here. Holy smokes, so probably go for the 2 oh whatever package, right? 2 2 package. Yes. Nah, bro, stop tripping. The baby was walking outside this morning. He's adorable. That is Mariko's child in room 202. As soon as Mariko noticed uh, me looking at her son, she grabbed her son and took him inside the house. Please stay away from my son. Am I like the germ to her? All right, I don't 
don't want to look. Dude, I honestly thought we were about to finish this game. I thought the game was over, dude. <laughs> Shit. All right, hold on. There's another package here. We have um, tool six. So tool six would be tool one. All right, tool six would be back upstairs. So tool six would be on the other side. I don't know if it's gonna be on this side it probably is just trying to do floor by floor tool six tool three now you see hmm, interesting so maybe we're just gonna go back upstairs we don't have anything for the third floor do we 305 let's go back up anything on the fourth 401. It's over there. All right, we're going to go to 401. Screw it. 501. 502. Bible tools right here. Today I gave a cat, a uh, cat to Eric in room 502. I also have a dog, so I wish I could get along well. She told me I was disgusting, but I believe there were no bad people who love animals. I was hurt, but. Hello? I'm, I'm kind of scared of like look, 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 looking at the doors. You never know who the fuck's gonna pop out of there. Okay, so the next one was gonna be 401, I think it was. Yes, 401. I thought I could get along with um, Chiru san in room 401 since we're close in age. I've never seen him uh, out of his room. I decided to visit him. He finally came out for the third time. I don't think anyone can get along with someone like you, he said. That's it. The door closed immediately. What the fuck is going on here, bro? This game's a mind fuck. And who do we who, who who do I give the money to? Do I keep the money or what? All right, so we've got two more packages: three hundred five and two hundred six. Three hundred five and two hundred six. So two hundred six is that way. Three hundred five. Okay, so I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna go back down through here. Oh, dude, this is crazy, bro. <laughs> this is crazy. Tool six. At Mr. At night, Mr. Takio and room tool six was uh, carrying a box filled with beer cans. I said, you might mean helping. Why the fuck are you trying to help? If you have time to help, you shouldn't be on welfare. You're just a burden to society. And Mr. Takio, what? Wonder if people around me think that way. <laughs> what the fuck? These people are not very nice. All right, so we got the last one, which is gonna be 305. So we're gonna head upstairs, and then the money probably take it to the priest, right? I mean, or maybe to the guy that gave us money for the priest. 305. Bingo. Adisa and room 305 is a student. She's also a part time, a part timer to the nearest convenience store. I can tell she's a hard worker, but. Um, and I respect that. When I thought she wouldn't say hello when she passed by, uh, when we passed by each other for the first time this morning, she said, are you stalking me? You ugly fuck. <laughs> I wasn't stalking. All right, so now the money. What do we do with the money? What do I do with the money? I forgot where, the, where, that, where that priest was. I think it was the first floor. I knew it. This morning, I saw Yugichi in room 105 walking. 
He seems to be a priest, and I thought he was a kind person. So I want to talk. What is the weak person doing? I don't want to see if you. Uh, I don't want to see it. Just uh, useless without money. Never show up in front of me, and uh, never show up in front of me ever again. He said maybe he was in a bad mood. I'm telling you, the priest is the cause of all of this. I'm gonna call it right now. And just when the elevator is looking a okay, I'm gonna go ahead and say this is a very bad idea. And what do you... Uh. Oh, holy fuck, what the fuck was that? This shit needs to end right now. What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? Lady, have your shitty ass bait. Get. Oh my god, what the fuck was that, dude? Oh god. Oh my god. I don't even want to take the elevator any I don't want to take the elevator anymore. Listen. Oh, fuck. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? I'm 404, huh? Oh, my God. All right, seriously, enough of this little crappy ass games. All right, S psychological horror. Screw this. Bro, the way that dude just came at me. Holy shoot. I didn't even know how to act. Why am I even going to lie to you guys? I, I didn't know how to act. Okay, so I know I said no jump scares, but that was bad. I don't know. You can see them through the glass or through the windows. Bro, knock on that freaking door. Let's go. Open up, punk. Another fucking house. Listen, this is going to be the last and final house I'm coming into. You understand? God, I really wish that I could uh, be able to read that. Oh, God. I'd rather be sucking on toes than playing this shit right now. the bathroom oh hold on that's the bathtub okay 
We know what happened. Oh, that's the fridge. Oh, that's going to be a dead body in the. Oh, fuck. Fuck me. Oh, my God. This is the head. My boy, I can't see anything. Okay, I, I got it. He, he's been beheaded. Me to sit here with you? Uh, I can just chill out here with you. No pun intended. You got the freezer there. I don't, I don't know where to go. What the frick is this? Bro, just drop the package and leave. Landlord. Oh, was he watching the tape all along? Oh. Oh, he was watching the tape all along. All right, flashlight it is then. So we're playing as the landlord now. Hmm, I thought this game was going to be shorter than it's been. <laughs> to my surprise, surprise, surprise. It has not been shorter. All right, what do we do here? I mean, everybody's dead. We saw the tape. We saw what happened at the apartment. Oh, shit. Oh, it is dark as hell. Was it room 404? Okay, so we're going to go to room 404. I would assume that's what we got to do. I'm the landlord around here. I'm the landlord around these streets. And we're going to do what I say, damn it. 404, the trash is no longer there, which is kind of interesting. I think this is where we have to go, 404. Oh, God. Hello? Where is the dead body, sir? Oh! Yes, I understand. Okay, so this is definitely, this is, that was extremely creepy. I'm not going to lie. That was just very uneasy the entire time. 100% the entire time. This is like no other game that I've ever played here on the channel. It's it's not very, it's, I mean, it's got jump scares, but it's not like jump scares after jump scares after jump scares. It's, it's, it's more of a, a, like I said earlier, like a vibe type of horror. It just makes you feel scared the entire time it's it's a sense of being uneasy as you're playing which honestly i think to me it's even worse because you could be playing the game out of nowhere and then bam jump scare it's quick and it's done but when you have it's a constant fear of getting scared it's when it's when things really suck but uh there you guys have it that's been the entire game night delivery amazing job uh big uh shout out to to the devs they did a fantastic job one hell of a little game I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I don't typically do these games again here on the channel, but I thought I should. Thought it'd be something a little different. And uh, man, oh man, that was <laughs> that was uh, that was pretty cool. Thank you guys. If you enjoyed it, drop it a like. 
and hopefully I will catch you on the next one. Okay, so notice I just I was just about to stop recording, but notice how the dog is in front of the room 404, which is the room where everything happened and where us the delivery man where we died and then the landlord died. Interesting.